Am I the asshole? For refusing to help my daughter with her car payment because she is a stripper? I 47 meters have a 22 year old daughter. She's in college and lives on campus. I agreed to help her make car payments, since she was in school. I was recently informed by a young man I work with that my daughter strips at a club about 40 minutes away. I confronted her on this and she said she didn't plan to do it after she graduated, and she needed some money. I told her then work at McDonald's, not use her body. We got into an argument, and I asked her to quit stripping and get a decent job then. She refused and said stripping was easy money, so basically I said there was no need for me to pay her car payment anymore since she is making money so easily. She got upset and said that wasn't fair, and that she doesn't make enough for that. I told her to figure it out. She told my wife about what happened, and my wife is upset by her job of choice but says it's unfair for me to stop supporting her so suddenly over an argument. I think it's perfectly fair, it's my money and my decision when to cut it off. Did you lecture your coworker for going to an indecent place? So in order to convince your daughter to stop stripping you stopped paying her car and now she has to strip more ha 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 nice one dude. The real R is the tattletale co-worker. A question how did this young man come to find out? Ok so you cut off her car payment so now your daughter will double down and take extra stripping shifts to pay for it. So cutting her off is not going to make her stop either way. Not use her body. What is she supposed to use at McDonald's? What kind of asshole tells a woman's parents that they saw their daughter stripping, as if that's any of his business to get into? Your gross co-worker, who goes to strip clubs to ogle women but then tattletales on them, is the biggest R in this emo. Yes, you're the asshole. As both a former short order cook and former strip club bouncer, believe me when I say that stripping is the more respectable profession. Just to be clear, you're cutting your own daughter off because people are looking at her jubblies. Really think about how conditional your love is. You're the asshole. I get it, I'm a dad with daughters, but you're being a dick. If you don't want her doing it then supporting her would be more effective, not cutting her off. You're also a hypocrite, because I guarantee that you've consumed some product of sex workers for your own pleasure. Good enough for other people's daughters but not yours huh? Your daughter can make twice as much if not more per hour as a stripper compared to MCDS. So she's either doing two four hour shifts or four four hour shifts. With classes and studying, I'd rather work eight twelve hours a week compared to sixteen twenty four to bring in the same amount of cash. If you push this, it will be her grades that suffer. You're the asshole. Whether you are the asshole or not isn't as important as what will happen if you quit paying her car payment. She's going to go looking for more money. Probably as strip clubs. You're the asshole. You'd continue the car payment if she worked at Mickey D's, but not if she's a stripper. It's expensive to go to college now, much more so than when you were that age. Look long and hard at why a job at McD's is preferable to a job that pays two to five times better than that. It's your money, sure. But it's also your relationship with your daughter. Are you willing to sacrifice that to prevent her from using her body? You're the arsehole by adding conditions to your agreement after the fact. You're the arsehole for shaming your daughter. You're the arsehole for not being a man of your word. Info. Who pays for her school housing? Is the car payment a financial hardship for you? Stripping aside, did she misrepresent her income in order to get you to pay her car note? Example, did she say she only makes $300 per month when in reality it's $3,000? You're the asshole. You're just making her need the job more. You're the asshole. Working at McDonald's would still be selling her body and having to deal with drunk misogynist assholes, but for a whole lot less money and respect. Info Why isn't your wife involved in monetary decisions regarding your daughter? Info Op, are you aware you're going to further push her into stripping by cutting her off financially? She's going to need more money now. 
Oftentimes, college students cannot work 30-40 hours a week what she'd likely need to work at McDonald's to make what she's making and still succeed academically. You're the asshole so your daughter's resorted to stripping to make money, which you hate. So your solution is to not give her money to pay for something she needs help paying for. Pushing her into stripping more and maybe taking on more risky work. Um. Do you understand how that's counterproductive of you, let alone just shows your love and care is conditional? Not very parent-like of you. You're the asshole. It's her body to use as she pleases. You're within your rights to stop supporting her but you're being enough for judging her. If you have an issue with stripping maybe do something about all the men that go to strip clubs. I find it astonishing people are calling you the R. I'd love to see how these people would react if their daughter was stripping. You're allowed to be immensely disappointed and cut her off. You're the asshole. Completely up to you if you want to stop helping her with car payments. She's an adult at 22 with a job and her own financial responsibilities. You're the asshole because you're making moral judgments on what she does and making threats over financial help unless she does what you want. Well, now she's really gonna need that stripping job. You're the asshole. Guess your word doesn't mean much does it? If she needs money then McDonald's wage isn't going to get her very much. All you've done is make sure she has to strip more often now to pay the bills. Good job. If you think McDonald's money compares to stripping money your wild, smiley face. You're the asshole. Not for not wanting her to strip but for cutting off support. Your daughter is in a dangerous environment working at a strip club. Of course you don't want her there. What you'd want even less I assume, is your daughter falling into trouble while working there and having no clue where to go who to ask for help BC her dad already cut her off. She has to make these choices and experience life on her own. It's your job to be there for her through the ups and downs. Nah. She's allowed to strip but you're not obligated to give her money. Boundaries. You're the asshole out of curiosity can you name a job that doesn't require the use of one's body? BC McDonald's is for sure a job that requires a body. You're the asshole. It's my money and my decision when to cut it off. Sure, but you're still being an asshole. You're the asshole. I can't help but wonder how she would manage to work at McDonald's without using her body. So confusing. I'm just curious what kind of lecture you gave your co-worker for going to a strip club, since you consider it so reprehensible? You're right, though. Your daughter should absolutely live only the life you expect of her. If she doesn't like it, she can live without your financial assistance, and you can certainly live without her ever speaking to you again. Good job respecting your daughter, dad. You'll receive back the respect you deserve. You're the asshole. I told her to work at McDonald's, not use her body. Do you think all the cooking and cleaning at McDonald's is done via telekinesis or something? You're the asshole you want her to stop stripping so you make it so she needs to strip more? Good job.